Hello everyone, welcome to the Bug Expert channel. In this video, we will talk about solutions for friends who encounter the Hogwarts legacy unable to connect to WB Games online services error. This error is usually caused by an unstable network connection. Of course, you may encounter such an error not only because of this problem, but also because of many other problems. For this, we will try to solve the problem by telling you a few suggestions. Before we show you solutions, we will briefly talk about the forum. You can forward various errors you encounter to the community on the forum portal we have opened. For this, if your problem continues or if you encounter a different problem, you can get a quick response by sharing it on the forum portal. We care about your questions and suggestions. If you are accessing the internet with a Wi-Fi connection, your connection may be weak. We can eliminate the problem by performing the cable connection to strengthen the connection access. If the error persists even though you have followed the suggestion, let's move on to the next suggestion. The unstable connection that occurs on your internet can cause various such connection losses, triggering some online running programs. There is a simple way for you to fix unstable network connection. This way is to reboot the modem. To do this, turn it off by pressing the power button on the back of the modem. To restart the modem 20 seconds after it is turned off, press the power button on the back and wait for it to work. If the Hogwarts Legacy game is open in the background after you provide internet access, close it completely and run it again to check if the problem persists. If your problem persists, we can eliminate the problem by using the default Google DNS server. Right-click on the internet icon in the lower right corner and select Open and Internet Settings. Click on the Change Adapter Options option on the screen that opens. After this process, right-click on the Ethernet option and access the Properties menu. Double-click on the Internet Protocol version 4 option in the Properties menu and save by applying the setting I showed in the video. After performing this process, type CMD in the Start Search screen and run it as an administrator. Paste the lines of code in the article in the command prompt window that opens and press Enter. After the process is complete, you can restart the computer and check if the problem persists. The fact that the game does not run as an administrator can cause us to encounter various errors like this. For this, we can eliminate the problem by running the game as administrator. Right-click on the Steam or Epic Games Launcher application. Let's open the Properties menu and apply the setting as I showed in the video and save it. After this process, let's set the Hogwarts Legacy game to run as administrator. Access the Hogwarts Legacy game folder. Right-click the Hogwarts Legacy.exe program in the folder and open the Properties menu. Then perform the save process by applying the compatibility setting as I showed. After this process, Close the Steam or Epic Games Launcher program that is open in the background completely and run it again and check if the problem persists. If your problem persists, we can fix the problem by setting the port configured for the Hogwarts Legacy Launcher. Type Windows Defender Firewall in the Start Search screen and run it. Click on Advanced Settings on the left side of the screen that opens. Select the Inbound Rules option on the left side of the screen that opens and click the New Rules option on the right. Select the port option on the screen that opens and proceed. Then, let's continue the process by setting the TCP option and pasting the port in the article. Then let's move forward by selecting the allow the connection option and continue by enabling all three features. After this process, let's save the name of the port we created. After successfully performing this operation, let's set the UDP port. In the same way, click on the new rule option and select the UDP option. After this process, let's give the port name by applying the previous settings in the same way and save the process. After completing the operation successfully, you can check if the problem persists by running the game. Maintenance work or crashing on Hogwarts Legacy servers can cause us to encounter various connection problems like this. To check the Hogwarts Legacy servers, you can follow the latest tweets by clicking the link we left in the article and reaching the Twitter platform. Yes. In this video we have provided information on how to fix Hogwarts Legacy unable to connect to WB Games online services error. If you are encountering various errors, you can reach the community with your questions by accessing the forum portal we have opened. By supporting us, we can expand our community. Thank you.